So last time we did the Reno2 review, we briefly glossed over these. The Oppo Anko Q1 earphones. Now I believe they deserve more than just 30 seconds because I think they are probably the best ANC earbuds out there that need to be talked about because at this price range, whether it's design, performance, or just ANC noise cancelling, these are really, really good. Just like a lot of the conventional ANC earphones out there, Oppo also opted for an ergonomic, flexible neckband design for active noise cancellation. The neckband itself is lightweight, rubberized, smooth with plastic outer tips and buttons on the inside for easy control. The TPU material is smoothed out and feels comfortable resting on your neck. Even though it's slightly on the big side, you almost barely notice it after wearing it for a while. Now, it will shift around your neck slightly if you do something like vigorous, like morning jog. And it does have an IPX4 rating, which is helpful as it protects the band from splashing water no matter which direction it's coming from. So, you'll be fine wearing these in the rain, but I wouldn't advise diving or like swimming with these on. Thanks to Bluetooth 5.0, the Anko Q1s pair up really quickly and easily with your phone. Within 10 meters of connection, I had a solid connection for at least over three walls. Pretty amazing. The buttons all feature a minimalistic design with power and the pair button over here, all your controls, mode interchange button here, and the active feed mic here. So, aside from launching Brino, Oppo's smart assistant, you can also use this to press to answer calls or hold to refuse calls. And also, I love this part. This volume control button over here also doubles as like a forward and backward selection button, so it's pretty cool. The magnetic clips that hold the earbuds together when you're walking is useful so they won't dangle around unnecessarily. The package comes in various sized silicone caps to fit snugly in your ears. I have different sized ear canals, so it's good to have these on hand for a secure fit and to provide additional passive noise cancelling when you listen to music. They don't feel uncomfortable at all. They're non-intrusive and stay well in regular office and home environments. All right, so now let's talk about the most important part of having these, the sound quality and noise cancelling. Oppo's Anko Q1s have a relatively balanced sound channel distribution across the left and right earbuds. The mids are slightly more pronounced and defined as opposed to the highs and basses. The basses are still there, but just sounds a tad bit flat than what I would have loved. With popular genres like pop, metal, R&B, these would do just fine and deliver a good, balanced soundstage for you. Now, they come with three modes. One is cinematic surround, gaming surround, and music mode. With cinematic and gaming surround, I found the sound to be more drowned out because of the earphones. You know, they sort of add like a virtual space between you and the sound. So I thought the regular music mode was really the best. Now, getting into the active noise cancellation performance, the Q1s do very, very well when it comes to blocking out noise, but it won't block out 100%. You get a good 80 to 90% noise reduction. On busy streets or noisy cafes, a lot of the environment noise is filtered out. And with music on, you'll easily forget them and just be immersed in your musical world. With quieter songs like piano solos or soft guitar, you'll still get some small volumes of noise seeping through. The closest thing I can compare these guys to right now are the Sony WIC600Ns. Man, they really need to work on their naming system. Anyway. Now, I won't compare the noise cancelling because while well, the Oppo Q1s are active noise cancelling and the Sony's are just regular noise cancelling. But sound-wise, the Q1s pretty much sound almost as good as the Sony's and plus they're 40 bucks cheaper. So right there, you got more value for your money. And aside from sound quality, the microphones work relatively well. Here's how it actually sounds when you answer calls using them. All right, guys, so right now I'm outside. The ambient sound is relatively quiet. All you hear are some wind and, you know, people like slight chit chatter. And this is probably the most direct sound you're hearing coming from the mic of the Oppo Anko Q1s. So, you know, kind of gives you an idea of what it's like in a relatively quiet area. What you're hearing right now is me at a Starbucks a good amount of noise. So the microphone is performing pretty well and the ANC is working very, very well too. With a full charge and ANC turned on, the Inco Q1s can last up to around 15 hours and takes about an hour or so to charge. This is a pretty good battery life for ANC earbuds of this size and price. All right guys, so that about wraps it up for the Oppo Anko Q1 earbuds. 
So hopefully this has given you a relatively good idea about what these guys offer and you know the kind of options you have in the market. So hopefully this was helpful for you guys. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys on the next one.